Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I want to take a couple of seconds just to talk about some simple motor calculations. There's only two. You've done both of these formulas before, I'm pretty sure. Um, if you've had electronics at least, if you haven't, we're going to talk about them right now. Okay, and so the two formulas that I want to talk about are these two right here, this one right here, and this one right here. Now, this formula here, n is equal to f times 120 over p, what that allows you to calculate is the sync speed of a motor if you know the frequency and the number of poles, okay? And it comes from this formula right here, or at least this formula here is the same. This is F is equal to P times N over 120. This one usually is used to calculate, you know, what's the frequency output of an alternator, if you know how many poles it has and how fast it's turning, okay? So these two are the same formulas. This one usually refers to alternators. This one here refers to motors, and this one you're usually calculating speed. This is handy if, you know, you want to calculate the sync speed. It's also handy if you have a in uh, a VFD, you know, and like what's the speed going to be if you run it at whatever frequency that you happen to be running it at, okay? Um, the other formula that I want to talk about really quickly is calculating the percent slip. And what the percent slip is really is, um, you know, how much is it slipping? Uh, for How much is it slipping from no load to full load, essentially, okay? So the lower the percent slip for a particular motor, the less it's slipping, or the less of its sync speed it's slipping. And so the lower the percent slip, you know, kind of the better the speed regulation of the motor, okay? And it is the sync speed, which we can calculate, minus the actual speed, full load speed, or the nameplate speed, okay? all over the sync speed. And so basically what this top is, is the sync speed minus the full load speed. So it's the, <coughs> excuse me, amount of slipping divided by the sync speed. Okay, guys? And then times 100 to get it into a percentage. Okay, and so as an example, we're just going to take up this question here. Okay, so a four pole motor runs at 75 hertz. It says calculate the sync speed. Well, let's calculate the sync speed. The formula is, N, which is speed, right, is equal to F times 120 over P, which is the number of poles. Um, and so the frequency is 75, guys, and uh, 120 is just a constant, right? And uh, P stands for the number of poles, which is uh, 4. Okay, and if I calculate that, uh, let's do it right here. It's 75 times 120 equals divided by four equals. Looks like this thing is gonna have a sync speed of 2250 RPM, right? Okay, guys, and so that's all. That's all there is to it, okay? Now, um, this same motor, the nameplate indicates that it runs at 2000 RPM. Got like the percent slip, so let's do that. We're gonna use this formula right here. Percent slip, well, it should be the sync speed, which we just calculated. 200250 minus the uh, full load speed or actual speed. In other words, this is going to calculate the amount it's slipping, and then we're going to divide it by the sync speed. Okay, and so no big deal, right? 2250 minus 2000 equals, that's the 2500 RPM it's slipping, and then we're going to divide it by 2250. And we're going to find out that it's 0.11, you know, 1. And then we're going to times it by 100 to get it in percent. And so it's going to be 11.1%, okay? And that is the percent slip of this particular motor. All right, guys? So I just wanted to show you that, guys, so that you can do the last little bit of homework and uh, also be ready for the test, okay? So... I think that you should be able to do this handout right here, Unit 5, Handout 7, okay? And it's called Motor Calculations. And that'll be, you know, just a few questions. And that'll allow you to get uh, ready for the test by doing the test review, which is Unit 5, Handout 8, okay, guys? And the next thing you're going to do after that is the test. And by the way, it's been fun. All right, guys? Enjoy.